Questions 85 through 89 are saying use the diagram below, and the diagram is just a right triangle, and all we have is the labels of the vertices. We have vertex H, G, and K. Let's take a look at the question. Well, it looks like they're just asking us uh, to, to go over what we already really used in questions 79 through 84. 85 is asking which side or what side is the hypotenuse? Well, the hypotenuse is always either the longest side. You could also call it the side that's opposite, I'm sorry, across from the right angle. Or again, you can think of it as the side, the triangle side, that does not touch the right angle. HG touches it, GK touches it, but HK does not. So which side is the hypotenuse? Let's just call it by its vertices, HK. You could also write this as K. H. Either one of those would be a correct answer. Which leg is adjacent, adjacent to angle H? We'll take a look at angle H. The hypotenuse will never be adjacent. It's always the hypotenuse. The adjacent side is the side that is, or the leg, that is touching angle H, and that would be HG. You could, of course, also call that side GH. All right. Which leg is adjacent adjacent to angle K? Let's be careful now. Now we're using a different reference angle. Taking a look at angle K, again, the hypotenuse will never be opposite or adjacent. So looking at angle K, the adjacent leg to angle K is GK. It's the leg that touches angle K. You could also write this, of course, as KG. Number 88, which leg is opposite of angle H? So opposite of angle H. Let's go back to angle H and take a look. The leg that's opposite is the leg that does not touch angle H, and that would be GK. or we could also call that KG, and notice class, the adjacent leg to angle K is actually the same leg as the opposite leg to angle H. And that makes sense because when we choose a different reference angle, H or K, the opposite and adjacent legs actually switch around. Which leg is adjacent to angle K? Let's take a look at it. Angle K the adjacent leg to angle K is next to angle K, or touching angle K, and that's GK. So the leg that's adjacent to angle K is GK. And actually, I just noticed here, class, there's a typo here. I was wondering why I was getting the same answer. Number 87 is the exact same question. What leg is adjacent to angle K? 89, what leg is adjacent to angle K? Probably they meant to write on here which leg is opposite to angle K. And I may have already corrected that on your printout, but because my version is showing adjacent, it's going to be GK. If the question was what leg is opposite to angle K, that would be HG. Here's angle K, opposite leg, the leg that does not touch angle K is H, G. Okay, we're done with that group. I'll go ahead and finish this video. We'll start up with number 90 on the next video.